A game changer suddenly appears in the private jet world. The Airbus A220. Tailored for globetrotting executives, this aircraft redefines luxury travel standards, creating an entirely new segment for ultra-large business jets. How did this upgrade and why it changes aviation? Let's dive into today's episode. The Airbus A220 is a lightweight commercial aircraft produced by Airbus. Before being acquired by Airbus and renamed the A220, this aircraft was known as the Bombardier C-Series, which included CS100 and CS300. It is one of the most advanced aircraft in its segment, featuring a modern design, fuel efficiency, and medium-range flight capabilities. The aircraft has two main variants, the 100 and the 300, with seating capacities of approximately 100 to 120 and 120 to 150 passengers, respectively. It has become a popular choice for airlines worldwide, especially on short and medium haul routes thanks to its flexible operation and high economic efficiency. It uses fly-by-wire technology, a significant advancement in Airbus's history. In the 1980 FS, the A320 became the second commercial jet after the Concorde to use this technology, helping propel the manufacturer to compete with Boeing. The 20th of May, the Airbus's smallest passenger aircraft, but it looks quite substantial compared to the specialized commercial jets on display. It's one of the two aircraft at eBase that require a jet bridge to board, along with a Boeing 737 MAX. As you might know, Airbus also offers a private jet version of the A220 through its corporate jets division, known as the ACJ220. So let's take a look at how it is designed on the inside when it becomes a private jet. Thanks for following until this part. Please don't forget to subscribe if you are new here. Now, let's move to the next part to explore amenities on the A220 business jet. Richard Guyona, CEO of the charter airline Comlux, mentioned that the company typically sells its aircraft at around $80 million. He added that the company serves a different market compared to Boeing business jets. Airbus showcased the commercial A220 jet at eBase, an aviation conference in Geneva. The Airbus A220, its smallest aircraft, is produced at several facilities, including in Canada and the United States. The factory in Mobile, Alabama produced this aircraft model for the American market. The aircraft features the largest windows in its category, providing passengers with expansive views and better natural light. In terms of range, Airbus states it can fly continuously for up to 12 hours, with a range of 6,500 miles, which is approximately 10,460 kilometers. The commercial version, however, can only fly up to approximately 6,600 kilometers. This is indeed a special feature compared to the standard version. If you had the chance to fly in the A220 business jet, what feature would you be most excited to experience? The expansive windows, the extended range, or something else? Although it may be Airbus's smallest passenger aircraft, it appears quite substantial compared to the specialized commercial jets on display. It is one of the two aircraft at eBase that require a jet bridge for boarding, along with a Boeing 737 MAX. The interior design of the aircraft is also very sophisticated. The entryway features intricate design elements between the kitchen area and the cabin floor. Additionally, it includes a small kitchen area with a coffee machine and a variety of cups and glasses. The A220 uses a fly-by-wire system, replacing traditional mechanical flight controls with computer-based controls. It is considered safer due to fewer failure points and lower repair costs. Fewer parts and lighter wiring also contribute to better fuel efficiency. Airbus pioneered the use of this technology in commercial aviation. Before the A320's introduction in 1987, fly-by-wire was only found on the Concorde and military aircraft. The ACJ220 can be designed in various configurations, and this particular design seems tailored for corporate use. Notably, this aircraft does not feature the large beds found in other ACJ220 models, but instead has more seating and meeting areas. The A220 uses advanced fly-by-wire technology, making it safer and more efficient. Do you believe this technological edge is a game-changer for private jets? This private jet also features a rear bathroom equipped with purple LED lighting and all necessary amenities. This is one of the most fuel-efficient aircraft in its category. 
with fuel consumption up to 20% lower than other similarly sized planes. A notable feature is its ability to take off from shorter runways. The A220 can operate from shorter runways compared to many other aircraft, making it well-suited for airports with limited infrastructure. The A220 that has been converted into a business jet will serve high-end customers or government organizations. These aircraft are often customized with luxurious interiors to meet personal or business needs. However, it is not as commonly used as a private jet compared to smaller aircraft models as its size and operating costs are typically higher than what is required by typical private customers. While the Airbus A220 offers exceptional comfort and performance for those seeking a modern private jet, the Boeing 737 is equally impressive when customized for private use, with greater carrying capacity and a wider range. Let's take a look at what's inside this aircraft. Boeing is known for its defense, space, and commercial airplanes. Even this aerospace giant has other strengths, including the private jet market. In 1998, Boeing launched its first Boeing Business Jet, BBJ for short, based on the 737-700. The concept has since expanded to include the Dreamliner, 777, and 747-8 series. After upgrading the 737 to a MAX version, Boeing continued intending to launch a business jet version. On April 2, 2014, Boeing announced the BBJ 737 MAX 8 and an initial order from an undisclosed customer. In terms of style, the concept of the BBJ MAX Genesis is inspired by the serenity of nature, the clouds floating above white sands, gently rolling hills, and a starry night sky. The goal of Genesis is to create an environment where passengers genuinely want to stay on board. With such a romantic objective, the name Genesis was launched. With this name, the company created what can only be described as the most beautiful private jet concept on Earth. It costs up to $110 million. Inspired by the starry sky, the ceiling is adorned with thousands of tiny LED lights, adding sparkle and charm to the jet's interior. Particularly notable are the smooth, organic curves in the design, which eliminate the sharp, rigid furniture typically found in aviation cabins. The common space is divided into areas for relaxation, meetings, and work, with a large dining table for board meetings or formal dinners. This design will make you feel as though you are floating among the stars, rather than simply flying through the sky. It can be said that the most important space in any private jet is the master bedroom, and this one does not disappoint. A king-size bed is surrounded by lead lights, giving the impression that it is almost floating above the floor. The special point is that the manufacturer has integrated a cabin window at the head of the bed, making customers feel as if they are on a luxurious vacation at a high-end hotel where they can even stargaze through the window. How romantic. In terms of amenities, the bedroom features a large TV that rises from a side cabinet, creating neatness when not in use. There is ample space for clothes, and the ceiling has the same starry design as the main cabin. The highlight has to be the private bathroom, which includes a spacious rain shower and a large roomy storage cabinet. In addition, this aircraft has an impressive range of up to 12,964 kilometers, far exceeding the standard commercial version. This allows the plane to undertake intercontinental flights without needing to stop for refueling. The cabin of the BBJ has an area of up to 93 square meters, several times larger than that of small private jets. This spaciousness provides maximum comfort for passengers on long flights. While the commercial version can carry hundreds of passengers, the business variant typically accommodates only 19 to 25 passengers, creating a private and unique flying experience. With the BBJ's spacious cabin of up to 93 square meters, accommodating only 19 to 25 passengers, do you think the enhanced comfort and privacy justify the cost? As mentioned, thanks to advanced engines and aerodynamic design, it consumes about 14% less fuel compared to previous BBJ models, helping reduce operating costs and increase sustainability. A special feature is that customers purchasing this aircraft can fully customize the interior to their favor, from luxurious bedrooms and bathrooms with showers to modern meeting rooms. If you had the chance to own one of these two private jets, would you choose the Airbus A220 with its modern design and superior fuel efficiency, 
or the Boeing BBJ 737 MAX with its spacious, beautiful, and luxurious cabin. Comment one if you prefer the A220, or two if you love the Genesis more. Thanks, and see you next time.